Jackie Whitey's fella, driven by George Musoff. You probably have not heard of George Musoff. He does not race in the New York area normally, but he has been handling and training and driving this Colt and drove him to victory in 156 and four-fifths at the Meadowlands and has won 70,000 with him this year, much of it in New York State campaigning, where he was second behind brand new fella uh, just a few weeks ago at Syracuse. 2B is pumping iron. Archie McNeil drives the royally bred son of Meadow Skipper. The horse has won 13 of 23 this year and $108,000, including his last three starts at Scioto in Ohio. Number three, letter C, is Jay-Z Leader. Jim Doherty drives. You heard Spencer talking to Jim Doherty, and Jay-Z Leader was the winner, as he mentioned, of last week's leg at the freehold when he won in 158 and two-fifths in a close finish with Scenic John, who is also in here tonight. Number four, letter D, Solar Pirate. Joe Marsh Jr. drives. You'll remember him from the New York circuit. He was pretty strong earlier this year. He's been 13 times first to second, has won $92,000. 5E, Nordic Elmerhurst. Here is a three-year-old Colt that has won 94,000 and has won in 154 and 154 and three-fifths at the Meadowlands earlier. Times there do not mean that much because uh, they go some very fast times and the 154 would in uh, normal times make you think this is a world beater. He is not, but he's a good Colt. Any Colt that can go there is a tough Colt and he has one of the top drivers in Ray Remen in the bike. 6F, Mike's happy fella. Frank O'Mara drives third last week at Freehold behind Jay-Z Leader and Scenic John, and a winner earlier in 157 at Scioto Downs over the 5 8 mile track there, and in 158 and one at Brandywine. O'Mara is always dangerous with his horses, and this one's won eight races this year. Here is Hervé Fillion's familiar colors of red, white, and blue, and the Colt is 7G Scenic John, a three-year-old by Albatross, owned in part by Fillion's Capitol Hill Farms of New Jersey, a winner of five races this year, but five times second and third as well, with 77,000 on the card. Just missed that free hole last week against Jay-Z Leader, being uh, beaten only ahead right at the wire. And you... Uh, can be sure that he will be a factor here. 8-H is Chipman's Jr., and you can almost be sure that he won't be a factor. He is driven by Wayne Givens, who does most of his driving down in the circuit near Washington and Baltimore at Free State Raceway and up at Brandywine, and it would seem that this three-year-old Colt has a mighty big task, particularly from the outside. That's the field for the $100,000 Canadian-American pacing Updating series. tonight's OTB pick four. We started in the second race with number five, letter E, Manart Odyssey won it for Bill O'Donnell with a mile in 202 and two fifths. Continued, of course, in the fourth race, which was won by number four, letter D, Cicero's Dream, driven by Hervé Fillion with a mile in 202 and a two fifths. And then in the fifth race, 5E e Slapstick finally gets home a winner for Jack Parker Jr., 158 and two fifths, as that good three year old Colt returns to form. So as we head into the sixth race finale to the OTB pick four, it is E, D, and E. And as they go in behind the gate, if you couple that with 1A, Whitey's fella, it gives you a probable pick four payoff of $2,707.50. With 2B, pumping iron, $346.20. Archie McNeil drives pumping iron, George Musoff, Whitey's fella. 3C, Jay-Z leader and Jim Doherty, the payoff $628.20. 4D Solar Pirate Joe Marsh Jr., the probable pick four, 2,707.50. With the 5E Nordic Almahurst and Ray Remen driving, $882. With 6F Mike's Happy Fella and Frank O'Mara, $2,081.70. With 7G Scenic John, Hervé Fillion in the bike, $901.80. And with 8H Chipman's Jr. and Wayne Givens, the probable payoff is $13,540.20. We'll see right now, along with you, who wins it as Bob Meyer calls the action. They're off. Jay-Z leader the center track tries for the lead. Whitey's fellow low on the inside second. Mike's happy fellow towards the outside third. Pumping iron on the rail fourth. That's... Uh, Around the turn, Jay-Z leader has the lead. Mike's happy fella on the outside of challenge and get the lead. Straightening out down the back stretch, Mike's happy fella in front by a length and a half. Jay-Z leader second. Gap of two lengths, Whitey's fella third. Nordic Almahurst fourth, pumping iron fifth. 
Solar Private on the rail, sixth. Scenic John alongside seventh. Chipman's Jr. is eighth. Quarter time is 29 seconds flat. At the paddock turn the first time, Mike's happy fella in front by a length, Jay-Z leader second. Gap of a length and a half, Whitey's fella third, Nordic Almahurst fourth. Scenic John up on the rim fifth, pumping idle only inside sixth. Solar Pirate goes to the outside seventh, Chipman's Jr. is eighth. As they come by the stands the first time, Mike's happy fella has the best of it by a length and a quarter. Jay-Z leader on the rail second, Nordic Almahurst up on the rim third, Whitey's fella only inside fourth. Halftime, 58 and four. Around the clubhouse turn to second time. Mike's happy fella maintains a length advantage. Jay-Z leader on the rail second with Nordic Almahurst alongside third. Scenic John up on the rim fourth. Whitey's fella only inside fifth. Solar Pirate alongside sixth. Pumping Iron seventh. Chipman's Jr. is eighth. Down the back stretch. Mike's happy fella in front by three points of a length. Nordic Almahurst alongside second. Jay-Z leader on the rail third. Scenic John the outside fourth. Whitey's fella along the rail fifth. Three quarters, 129 and one. Around the far turn, Mike Sampy fella in front by a half length. Nordic Almahurst alongside second to challenge. Jay-Z leader looks for racing Maloney inside third. Scenic John alongside fourth. Whitey's fella on the rail fifth. Solar Pirate the outside sixth. They come to the top of the stretch. Mike Sampy fella on the inside. Nordic Almahurst on the outside. Battle for the lead. Jay-Z leader third. Scenic John the far outside. That's Nordic Almahurst with Jay-Z leader. And Scenic John, Nordic Almahurst in front. Here's the finish, 5E, Nordic Almahurst just does hang on by a neck. Tight photo for place and show between 3C, Jay-Z leader, and 7G, Scenic John. And now back to Stan Bergstein. E, Nordic Almahurst, owned by Alex Meyer, Andrea, and Louis Malice of New Jersey, pays 960, 480, and 384, Ray Remen. 7G, Scenic John, 680, 440, and 3C, Jay-Z leader, 380 to show. With an exact of five and seven, E and G paying sixty dollars and sixty cents, and that concludes the pick four as E D wins it. E D E E, and it pays eight hundred eighty-two dollars and 